Hi, my name is Brandi Allen, celebrity makeup artist here at Bye Bye Studio in Los Angeles, and I want to demonstrate how to do it yourself spray tan. So the key to having a beautiful spray tan is first make sure you exfoliate your skin. You don't want any texture left on the skin for the spray tan to catch. And also if you really want a smooth result, make sure you shave. Second, make sure you don't moisturize. You don't want the skin to emollient for the product not to stick. And also, make sure you wear a bathing suit and gloves. Because I'm a makeup artist, I'm going to demonstrate with my makeup brush and the product, but at home, I do suggest wearing gloves. All right, so let's get to work. I'm going to step away about a foot from her arm and begin to spray. Making sure I'm spraying evenly. Luckily we have this towel here, this is a little messy. So if you want to avoid mess, spray on your brush. Going to work the product in, making sure I'm catching all areas. I chose a light to medium color for her so it can look more natural and golden. Now because this product doesn't have SPF in it, I'm going to follow up with an SPF by Neutrogena. And this will protect her skin and also even out any blotchiness. And I'm doing this step before the product sets just to make sure I get any uneven areas. All right, so the product suggests that we wait 60 seconds, but I want to wait five minutes and make sure nothing transfers and the product is set. And we're back. So five minutes later, here's the results of a beautiful spray tan. Let's compare the two arms. Here's the untanned arm and here's the tan arm. Big difference. For more tips and tricks, please visit BrandyAllen.com or TheMakeupMix.com. Thank you.